Hi, this is Kiki from Midland High Heels. I'm here with Shadow Rise. How are you guys doing tonight? Good. 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 Uh, so, uh, with your EP alone, you have already accomplished quite a lot. Congratulations. Um, you have played big venues and uh, also reached a couple thousand, hundred thousand uh, plays on Spotify. Um, do you do your own promo and marketing or uh, do you have already a bigger partner involved? Well, uh, I think with that one we were kind of lucky because we, uh, there was this playlist and then like everyone listened to that song I guess, so that, that's, that's pretty cool. But for the, for the, for the other part, um, yeah, we have, uh, we're working together with uh, JBM events. And of course we do our own marketing via social media as, as much as we can, and yeah, so that's, that's how we do it these days, isn't it? Get, get the Facebook likes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Instagram. Yeah, yeah exactly. Plus. How do you manage to uh, do it all by yourselves probably, the social media? Yeah, yeah we have uh, Laura that does uh, Facebook and Instagram, and uh, you know, I'm actually running a web shop and the merchandise, and uh, yeah, that is... Uh, Daniel, he writes the uh, most uh, songs and the <laughs> so uh, Yeah, That's actually something that uh, caught my eye because I do a lot of online marketing and when I see your website and uh, with your shop integrated on it, yeah. it was like, yeah, that's how you do it. <laughs> if you want to sell albums, you put a shop in your website. <laughs> yeah. uh, was it your idea? Do you do all that by yourself? No, uh, we had uh, actually uh, the former uh, guitar player from the band, he uh, designed everything, but uh, yeah, we all came uh, for the idea together, so uh, yeah, it was every one of us. We, yeah. we decided that uh, this would be the best uh, course of action for the website. Yeah, cool. So before we talk about your new, uh, your upcoming album that you're working on, I have to um, ask you, Lara, is it also important for you, as the singer and front woman, to establish your own brand for yourself? Uh, yeah, I, I kind of... Um Maybe uh, it's more of, of something that I think of as a creative thing because you, you make music and you want to make it like a, a, a complete picture, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I guess in that way um, it's more about having everything, you know, um, uh, the right way in the right direction. Do same if, if you want to write some music, uh, it, it, of course you already have an idea about maybe um, how, it, how, it, how it should look, or maybe about the lyrics or stuff, I don't know, I just want everything to be complete and fitting to each other. How do you say that in English? <laughs> yeah. um, we're, we're a band. Yeah, it have to be, it moet kloppen. Het moet kloppen. Yeah, it has to work together. It has to work together. Yeah, so. Okay, cool. So how is the songwriting for the full length for your debut album going? Yeah, we're actually... We're, we're almost done. Almost done. Almost done. Yes, yeah. no, the songwriting is, uh, the songwriting is uh, all done. We have uh, 11 tracks ready. And we just need to record a few of them and then we'll be set for the, for the album. Yeah. Do you have a, an expected release date or something planned? Uh, we plan the release for this year, but we, we hope we can still manage to do so. But we're not sure. You've also been looking uh, for a new guitarist um, who can yes. also do the grunts. Yeah, true. Yeah. Um, do you already have uh, someone or are you still looking? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's right there. Yeah. Yeah. Introduce yes. yourself. Yeah, so I'm Jack Street, I'm from the UK. And these guys put out you know, a little YouTube audition thing and messaged me and said, hey, we're doing this YouTube audition, we'd like you to, uh, to take part. And so I had a listen, I thought, yeah, these guys are perfect fit genre wise. Know what they're doing, so that was pretty fast. Yeah, made a, little, made a little video, sent it over, and uh, had a little video interview as well because from the UK, so I couldn't really fly over in time. And uh, it but this is not well. the first time you have met in person, right? Yeah. Today, uh, yesterday, this is actually. the first trip. Yeah, yeah this is wow. our first gig. Our yeah. first yeah, rehearsal yeah. was yesterday. Yeah, so, so I flew over <laughs> yesterday, day four. Yeah, yesterday. Yeah, yeah. 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 so <laughs> I haven't been here very long. And you're still playing today, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, are you guys? I was coming home from work and you know practicing until I went to bed basically, getting all down and and until a little while ago I was a bit worried but actually then everything clicked and we're we're happy now. Yeah. Sounds I couldn't have guessed you all look 
just like a very good team, so I couldn't guess there was a new guy. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, I, I know Dennis yes. already for a long time. I was in a band with Dennis uh, before, mm -hmm. and now uh, yeah, and um, I actually asked him too for guitars. I'm like, mm, can you maybe play this? I probably can't play this. I'll try it, and then we couldn't afford. Well, I, I did try, and I'm the same now. Of course, of course, of course. I was uh, kind, of, kind of curious because I thought I, I actually don't know, but <laughs> yeah. then I was too positive. I tried for an hour, and then I said I can do it. So. <laughs> yeah, but you, yeah, but the bass are like. Yes, everything works. I can say base. Yeah, it's, it's like we're like we're Second oh, so game. nice. I'm so happy they're here actually. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. no, good to be so yeah. am I. Yeah, it's a very It was a close call for today's show, actually. Yeah. Uh, really was. Good afternoon, yeah. uh, in time. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Work There's a question us. that I uh, that we wanted to uh, ask uh, many bands, um, more importantly here in the Netherlands, because uh, we have noticed that here in the uh, in the metal scene where there are female uh, female people musicians involved, <laughs> <laughs> where there are women involved, uh, most of them are the singers. So. Um, do you have an idea, maybe, why are there more female singers than female musicians or instrumentalists? Uh, I think it's like better think... in the Netherlands there are more instrumentalists than in Germany, for example, where we come from. But um, why is that? I have an estimated okay. guess. Mm -hmm. Overall, there are more female singers than instrumentalists, not just in the metal scene, from what I've seen. So I think in the metal as well, it's, I think singing is more appealing to women for some reason and doing stuff with their hands, very stereotyping might be more of a thing to do for men, but I think... <laughs> <laughs> well, well, that's that's oh, yeah. 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 Watch out, Dennis, yeah. watch out. Yeah. 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 Sitting right no. next to us. <laughs> it's a positive thing, but generally I see more um, females singing uh, outside mental as well, so... I think it's, it's, it's a, a, a choice that you yeah. make um, consciously to have females singing because it, a female singer sounds like a female singer, whereas a female keyboardist just sounds like a keyboardist. And yeah, it's, it's a position you might want to just say, we want this, this is what we want the band to sound like. And so you, you go out and search for a, a girl to sing, mm -hmm. whereas otherwise you just go out and search for a keyboardist and they might happen to be a girl. But Laura, you started actually as a guitarist, right? Yeah, I, I, I tried. I that's, tried that's very hard. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, I, I'm, um, yeah. When I was 16, I was like, yeah, I want to play solos. You know, and I tried, and I was like, okay, hmm, I don't know, I don't know. And then I, I started, uh, actually, I just liked some songs, and I, st I started singing along with the songs and playing with the songs, you know. Um, but I, I don't know, I never came any further than um, just a few riffs, you know, that I really practice hard on, and just some chords, so I can, you know, write a, a, a singer-songwriter song or something, you know, I know, I know the chords a little bit. So that's, that's the only thing I can do, and I didn't feel like I, I was very good at it, so I just focused on singing. Mm -hmm. I just really want, at some point I was like, okay, I want, just want to be a really good singer, and let's just focus on that. <laughs> Well, sounds yeah. like we could bring it back in at some point, just get an mm. acoustic number. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 sing a song around the metal. Yeah, sing a song around the Yeah, I would really have to practice hard. Yeah, yeah. 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 very hard. <laughs> yeah. Cool, thank you so much. Is there anything else you want to say? Mm. Stay metal. Yeah, yeah. 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 Cool. keep rocking. Yeah. And if you know why there are more female singers than instrumentalists, then um, give us a comment and hit us up. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. we're curious.